There's a deadly stabbing. The Pinpoint News tracker showing you Harrison Street in Providence. That's where a man was attacked inside an apartment last night and stabbed several times. The victim, Gary Mitchell, died from his injuries. Today, a dramatic day in court. The suspect, Lakeisha Garrett, collapses to the ground. She is now charged with murder and is being held without bail. It is our top local story on Eyewitness News at 6. Eyewitness News reporter Daniel North joins us live in Providence with more on the investigation and details on the victim. Again, that victim is 42-year-old Gary Mitchell of Providence, and both his friends and even his church pastor tell Eyewitness News he almost lived two very different lives. He had struggles on the street and with drugs in the past, but he was also extremely devoted to his Providence church. Ms. Garrett, you're being charged with the murder of one... 33 year old Lakeisha Garrett is facing one count of murder for allegedly stabbing 42 year old Gary Mitchell to death. Police say the two were involved in a violent altercation inside the basement apartment of this Harrison Avenue home on Thursday. It's one thing about Gary, he loved the church. Tonight, the pastor of the Holy Cross Church in Providence speaks exclusively with Eyewitness News about the victim, telling us Mitchell lived a conflicted life, having had problems with drugs in the past, while also being extremely gifted. Mitchell was the church organist. He played every Sunday and at weddings and funerals. I'm going to miss his trying to make it. I'm going to miss the fact that he was trying to become an example. He was robbed of the life that he wanted to completely achieve. Bishop Farrow also tells us he knew the suspect in this case, and much like family members of the victim, he doesn't know what led up to this fatal fight that ultimately killed this father of one. Violence is a spirit which enters into people, and it uh, has a, its way of taking control. And now the Holy Cross Church in Providence will be preparing for Mitchell's funeral next week. In the meantime, we can tell you the suspect, Lakeisha Garrett, is now being held without bail. She'll be back in court the end of this month. We're live tonight with the Providence Mobile Newsroom. I'm Danielle North, Eyewitness News.